morning everybody so I am outside of value village right now I'm getting ready to do some thrift shopping today so I'm gonna go to three or four different thrift shops today and just see what they got see if there's anything unique that I can find a um, little bit of backstory about value village I actually dislike value village <laughs> um, I think they are really overpriced but sometimes you can find a good deal so we're gonna go here I haven't been here in like a year <laughs> so we're gonna go to value village and then we're gonna go to maybe three others and uh, so I thought I'd take you guys along with me. We just have a jumble of things here. Christmas cow. That's kind of cute. That's kind of cute. Ten bucks, but oh, and it's got a chip out of the front top. It's kind of expensive for that, actually. Lots of these. These are awesome for putting little stuff. A whole bunch of kitchen gadgets. I do need a salad spinner. Five bucks. Not very good quality. Oh, that's pretty. It's really pretty. I don't know what that is. What are these? If anybody in the comments knows what these are, please let me know. I have no idea what these are. I love baskets. <laughs> I have so many of them though already. Ooh, an ice cream maker. I've been looking for one of these. It's a Cuisinart too. 
Hmm, might need to think about that. Bunch of clothes. Oh, my favorite section, books. I love these little kinds of shelves. These ones look like they're broken though. I am a huge book lover. You're going to see a common theme throughout the day here where I gravitate towards the books. I love finding a good deal on books. Um, all different kinds of books. Okay, so I'm at the next thrift shop. Um, we only found a handful of CDs at um, Value Village, so I didn't want to pay the price for most of the other stuff. So I didn't find anything of significance. I kind of have a rule that if I don't have a use for it or a place for it, I don't buy it. <laughs> so we are now at Salvation Army of Canada and we're gonna go in here. Um, I like looking for dishes here. Dishes and um, pans and stuff like that. And as I was saying in the at Value Village, I'm a huge fan of um, books. So I, that's one of my favorite things to find at thrift stores is books. And my daughter's looking for vinyls and CDs. So <laughs> we're about to go in. In these stores, they had the radio playing in the background, so that's why I have the sound off. And I'm just going to insert a song here for you guys to listen to while we're shopping. Um, copyright reasons. We found one of these cute little phones that I used to have when I was little. Um, it was it just brought back memories. <laughs> my daughter, my daughter remembers having one when she was a child too. It was a very cute moment. really liked this platter but I have a few platters already that I have trouble finding room for so I I decided not to buy this um but I really did like it I also found this um I'm not even sure what these are called a, like a butter churn no not a butter churn it's like a 
I can't think of the name right off the top of my head, but you put butter in it and you put water in the bottom and it keeps your butter fresh. I actually have one of these in teal. Um, so that's why I didn't buy this, but it was a really good price. I got mine for like almost $30 on Amazon. These bowls here, I do end up buying them. They're only a dollar a bowl and they're from Stokes. Really, really good price. Um, I actually have bowls that I have previously bought and that my family don't like because they don't stack nicely. So I end up buying the set of four of those blue bowls in order to replace those ones. fact about me I actually love doing uh, jigsaw puzzles but I do not buy them from a thrift store or from garage sales mainly due to the fact that I am scared there's going to be pieces missing so <laughs> I don't want to do the entire puzzle and then find there's a piece missing that would be really frustrating <laughs> Hello guys, so I am at the third thrift shop. Um, it's a hosp hospice thrift store. Um, they, when you shop at these thrift stores, it benefits our local hospice in our hospital and all the proceeds go to them. So I like to go to a few of these. We actually have four of these in the city I live in. So we're gonna be going to two or three of them. And um, yeah, so let's see what we can find. In the previous, um, thrift store I bought those blue bowls you were looking at and my daughter found some more CDs <laughs> so I'm gonna go in and let's let's I'm not gonna film uh, when I go to the other stores so it's just gonna be all one continuous shot here
I end up buying that little ceramic pot that I was looking at on the shelf. I thought it was adorable and I can totally use it. And then I bought Ina Garten and a company's coming cookbook. Um, both two of my favorite kind of cookbooks. I love Ina Garten and I love company's coming cookbooks. They're very informative kind of cookbooks. <laughs> a minute to figure out what these little tree things were it looks like a christmas tree with like a little ring on the side and i couldn't figure out what it was and then i realized it was to put out a candle um yeah <laughs> so everyone i just finished with the last thrift store now i gotta go do grocery shopping so um i think this is where i'm gonna end the video for today um i hope everybody has a merry christmas and i'll see you in the next video bye